Wrestling fans, here we are, Worldwide Wrestling, right here, War on the Shore, Carolina Beach, North Carolina, first match of the night, getting things started. You see referee Mark Denny making his way to the ring and coming through that curtain right now. Zane Dawson, we've been trying to get him at NWA Worldwide for quite a while. We finally got him tonight. I'm sitting here with NWA Worldwide owner Johnny Lightning. Lightning, what are your thoughts on finally getting Dawson into the ring here at NWA Worldwide? Well, like you said, we've worked very hard trying to get this young man in here. Uh, uh, runs all the time all over the uh, East Coast. Uh, uh, kind of a woolly booger looking. And well, here he is. There's he's living up to his reputation. I don't think that's his dad. I think he's already ticked off one of our fans. And he's in the ring. Marty Leffler has no idea what to do right off the bat. Here, here he is, Marty. Helping us out tonight at NWA Worldwide. Marty, of course, a legend in the NWA uh, as an announcer. And he is just <laughs> beside himself uh, bewildered with what to do. He's just kind of standing there not knowing what's going on right now as Zane Dawson finally gets into the ring. I'll bet if you shave Zane Dawson and give him a haircut, he'd look just like that guy right there. I guarantee it. <laughs> Mar Marty is not going to move out of this position because he he's like not he's real scared, sure. Right? He's not real sure. I think he's afraid. About wrestling fans coming into the ring. But I tell you, we get all types here at NWA Worldwide, that's for sure. And Zane Dawson is still – jawing at this guy it's going to be interesting to see how this turns out as this match progresses and coming through the curtain right now his opponent mark james uh mark was on our last show with us he got picked out by harley race uh to appear on the last show here during the harley race seminar now we've got him back in carolina beach and he's facing off against zane dawson this is not his first match these two have a history together uh and this is going to prove to be very interesting because uh, as you can tell Zane is not making friends with the crowd right off the bat, but uh, they're going to get right behind Mark James uh, and uh, show Zane Dawson what they think of him from the start. No doubt. I mean, uh, Mark James, I've known his boy for many years. Actually, right when he first got into the business, uh, Mark, he's probably 10, 15-year vet now. Uh, it's going to be a good match. I've done, I've done had high hopes for this one. Yeah, and, uh, and Zane is still still jawing at the crowd. I mean, he is not going to make any friends here at Carolina Beach. And uh, it's going to be interesting to see how this plays out. I, you know, I wouldn't be surprised if one of the crowd members hit Zane Dawson with a steel chair before this thing's all over with. Uh, I would not be surprised either. I don't even think uh, Zane's mama likes him. I mean, he is uh, a unique type of person. Let's go to that route. A unique is a good way to describe it, that's, that's for sure. And... Uh, Mark James definitely has uh, something to say about the, the Zane Dawson thing. He's uh, he's on the lower end of the win column against Dawson, but he's promised tonight that that's not going to be the case. We'll just have to see how he fares in this this our opening match here at War on the Shore in Carolina Beach. It should be, like I say, it should be a very interesting match. I've been wanting to see these two hook up anyway. Um, I'm, I'm going to make a statement here. I think the long hair on Zane Dawson is going to come into effect. Now, that would be the first thing I would go after, just to be honest. Well, you know, uh, you're known for, for, for being a little bit of a bad guy when you were in the ring. You you won it at any and all cost, and uh, I don't think Mark James is quite on the same page if you were during your wrestling career, Johnny Lightning, but we will see if he uses that long hair to his advantage uh, during the course of this match. God, I hope so. I mean, it's there. you got to use it. You know, that's the way you look at it. His is so long, you can wrap it up in your hand a couple of times. Well, he may be leaving to go get a haircut right now. That would be right. right. He that may have taken your advice. It looks like the crowd has listened to you, and they are in approval for Zane Dawson getting a haircut right now. Um, looks like he's contemplating it. He's not real sure running those fingers through that hair, but he hey, may have been motioning you. I, I see what you're talking about. That could have been what the hand gesture was. And there's absolutely no telling on him here. We're really not. We, uh, uh, but we're glad to be back in Carolina Beach anyway, whether it be Zane Dawson, Mark James. And, and Mark James is doing the chicken dance in the middle of the ring right now. I guess he's getting ready for uh, a wedding party <laughs> coming up maybe. Who knows? <laughs> there's no telling on this boy. Maybe he's just mocking. Zane Dawson ready for him to get in the ring and get this action started. No doubt. Uh, the chicken dance. That's funny. I ain't seen that in years. Uh, nice. Collared elbow lock up. And uh, there, right to the right head. Right to the head and lock. There we go. Action right in the center of the ring where it needs to be. 
Oh, can you imagine the melons getting pushed right now? Nice show and shoulder block. And maybe he shouldn't have done that little 360 spin there, maybe. Not sure what Zane Dawson was trying to do, but uh, he ended up on his back after that little maneuver. I ain't, I, I seen that one other time. George South used to do that, and it didn't work out too well for him either. So he needs to, to, to quit with the George and get on with the Zane. Let's do that. Zane may be just a little bit nervous of this being his first match here at NWA Worldwide. We know he wants to impress the owners and the management. A good lock up right in the center of the ring into the headlock for Dawson. As Mark James tries to work his way out of it. Now would be a good time. He could have grabbed that handful of hair. Albeit illegal, it would have been to his advantage, Johnny. Michael. See, that's what I'm trying to say. And oh, miss with the clothesline. Big hip toss. Look at that. Nice. He's sitting right down the small of that back for Zane Dawson. And it looks like he's heading out of the ring again. Looking for a little timeout here. Referee Mark Denny on the count trying to get the action started back in the center of the ring. I like Mark Denny. He's a, he's a nice little riff. I, I do. I like him. Did you just say you liked somebody? Well, well, sorry. He's a good ref, you know. Well, that's unusual for you to ref. say that you like any referee, though. I'm just, you know, I'm just saying. There's a few out there that I like, you know, the ones you can pay. I mean, the ones that, that overlook stuff once in a while. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's, I understand where you're coming from now. Back to the shoulder. Back to the bribery. That's not that. And another hip another toss. Another hip toss. Look at that. Didn't quite get the height on that last one they did the first one, but it's still very effective. Very yeah. effective. Right on the small of the back for Zane Dawson, and he pulls him right in that second turnbuckle. Mark James made a mental error there. He's got to remember his history with Zane Dawson. Zane Dawson is a dirty player. He'll take every advantage he can. You cannot sneak up on that man. You've got to be ready when you get up at him. Or Zane Dawson's going to do just what he did right there. He's going to take advantage of you and get the upper hand right in the center of the ring as he bears down that trap of uh, Mark James. I ain't seen that since 1973. Man, that's old school right there. My goodness. Where in the world did that boy learn that from? I have not seen that. That's great. But uh, I'm starting to like the Zane Dawson kid a lot more. Uh, known him for years, but uh, I haven't seen him uh, compete in a long time. And uh, I'm starting to like this bad boy look that he's got going. Well, he, de he definitely does what it takes to win. And uh, that's going to take its toll on, on the strength of that oh, right up. arm of Mark. James, yep, yeah, elbows right into the midsection. Oh, big knee flip James right over. That will take the win right out of you and put you down in a hurry, I'm telling you, Johnny Lightning. Zane Dawson is a master at taking every advantage he can take to win a match. No doubt. Nice. Big elbow. Nice, big And another one. Oh, well, Greg Valentine moves. Look at that. Just keep dropping. And goes, and goes right for the pin, hooks that leg. Only a one count. Mark James kicked out quick on that one. Ah, this oh, he's holding up two. I must have missed one of the counts there. It was fast, but uh, yeah, it's uh, He's picking Mark James up. Let's see what he's going to end up doing. Head Big headbutt. Big headbutt. And Zane Dawson is taking it old school. We've got the, we've got the working on the, the nerve pinch on the neck on that trap, and then, then right into a headbutt. Some big elbows in the center of the ring. Now he's going up to that second rope. Could this be a flying? Yes, it is. Oh, Wheat Frog, and he missed it. Oh, missed it big, Leap too. Frog off the second rope, and Mark James, big nice. clothesline right in the center of the ring. Comes back, big elbow to the head, and Zane Dawson is a little bit miffed right now. Mark James has come right back and got control of this match. Big, big suplex. suplex. Big suplex. Big suplex. Go for the cover. There you go, boy. One, two, just a two count, almost a three. He was just inches away from coming down that three for Zane Dawson. Stay on him. Got Stay that shoulder him. up, come and Mark on. James is backing up. He better watch out. Zane Dawson will get... He Looks like he caught him with a foot right to the side of the face there. A glance and blow it looked like, but still, I bet you were very effective. But he needs to be careful going to the well this many times. Yeah. And he I missed up, you. missed up, and he you. caught that hamstring right across that top rope. That will pull a groin muscle, tear a hamstring, and it's going to give Zane Dawson just enough time to oh, come back. And Mark James turns know. it around on him. And goes for that cover, three. big Got three it. count, and he gets a win Got right it. in the center of the ring. Mark James pulls it off, and I wonder maybe if he played a little bit of possum on that hamstring stretch, or if he just pulled it out and showed that he had the heart to do what it took to pin Zane Dawson one, two, three, right in the center of the ring. That concludes our first match right here at uh, 
We're on the shore in Carolina Beach, North Carolina, and I'll tell you what, it was a big one with Mark James standing there victorious in the center of the ring, and Zane Dawson does not look like he knows what to think. He's not sure about this. He's not, he's not comfortable with Mark James taking the victory. I guarantee you he'll be back, and he'll be back with a vengeance. It won't be the last time you've seen Zane Dawson on the shore. Oh, and Mark James about took himself out rolling out of the ring right there. <laughs> and he knew he it. Knows it. He, he, knows it. he laughed at him. <laughs> That's great. <laughs>